All right, let's try this again. It's about 20 minutes later. The storm has calmed down. Uh, you see where I'm at? I've opened three packs. Yeah, three packs. Okay, I got a couple of Mythics, Hip Hip Hooray. And you maybe can still hear some thunder outside. So we're gonna give this another try. If this takes two videos, three videos, 33 videos, I don't care. We're gonna keep going. But, oh, I guess here's another, Siddhar Jabari, okay. So I missed a Mythic, I always seem to do that. Oh, and I got a Yarok? Oh, because I put that pack down and the lights went out. So here's what's in the third pack. Invasion of Tolvada, Blood Feather Phoenix. <laughs> okay, cool, great. Um, pack number four, box number one. Ah. Uh, <clears throat> Life is but a dream. Okay. Invasion of Regatha. Worth a lot of fire. Island. Older and Thrill Seeker. Combos with Multani and um, Yargle. Yargle. I feel like you gotta scream when you say his name. Yargle! Yeah, that's the only right way to say it. Old Dying and Wade Knight. Emoti. Igar. Um, yeah, Emoti. Igar. Didgeru and Hazaret, Hirobi Death's Whale. None of these are mythics, right? Right. And I got a token. Okay. 10 4. Here we go. Scissors. <clears throat> Kraken packs. All right. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da. Forest. The Ozolith. I played against somebody who had Atraxa and Ozolith in the same sealed deck. That was a barrel of laughs. Glistening Dawn. Lothiel. It's very unicorny, isn't it? All right. Lothiel, straight from Eldraine to your battlefield table. <clears throat> Good stuff. Invasion of Kamigawa. Forest. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's foil, too. That's so cool. I wanted... Oh, Urbra. I wanted this. Begin the invasion. This is one of my favorite arts I've seen ever. Actually, in foil, I guess it's a little tougher to see, but it's the same Phyrexian claw on multiple different planes. I think that's so <laughs> cool. Yeah, I, and that's a mythic too, dude. Urabrask, there he is, the mighty Urabrask, flipping into the great work, which is doesn't that sound like it should be a fake kind of you know like hey I fooled everybody it was the great work I worked y'all. I don't know. Okay. Urbrask. Sweet. Interdisciplinary mascot. Shanna. Emoti. Rowan's Talent. Awesome card. And Thalia. Like I say, it's great to have Thalia around. Thalia can help you win the game. Guarding Thrabin as she does. She needs a reprint. She always needs a reprint. Two mana one at least. The three mana one's good too. Hey, Invasion of Ikoria. I happen to like Zilortha, Apex of Ikoria. I think it's great. Galta Maverin, just dinosaurs left and right here. Dance with Calamity. Quinde. Valduk. Oh, Foil Extended Art Realm Breaker. Looks like there's something fancy behind it, but I just want to enjoy that for a second. Okay, I've enjoyed it. Shieldred, Whispering One. Ooh. Dun dun. Bum 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 bum. Was any of these mythics and I just kind of went too fast? Okay. Dun dun. Shieldred. And I wish these packs were a little easier to open. But maybe they help keep the moisture and humidity out. Lord knows they need it. Uh, Invasion of Mercadia. This has turned out to be an excellent card in Limited. I love this guy. Man, and really, it's I, I think this is one of the best invasions in the Limited format. Uh, Doomscar Warrior, Pylon, but I'm nobody. So, Guardian Scale Ward, Rona, Raf, Galta and Mavern again, and Luce, the Spell Chaser. Overgrown past, a few comments. Stoke the flames. I'm so glad they reprinted that. I love reprints that are cool and that make sense. And here's Kagula and Yudaro. And here's a Valkyrie. 
And Rowan is talented. And there's Renata, Inga, Moira, and Teshar. Hey, that's kind of cool. I dig that. I'll read that later. And there's Obosh. Love me some Obosh. Yay. Sweet. All right, so yeah. Yarok is a decent mythic. Urbrask is a decent mythic. I love the beginning of the invasion. I think that's cool. And uh, yeah, this has, been a, this has been a cool box. Plenty of fun cards to play. Ooh, speaking of cool box, Thalia and the Gitrog Monster. Regular pack foil. This is going to be as rare as some of the variants, really. So, okay, there's Thalia and the Gitrog Monster. Breach of Multiverse. Ski Mathef. Daxos. Timoret. Archpriest of Shadows. I played against that in Limited. That wasn't fun either. And here's Squee the Immortal. Here he is, and now he's gone. So this is this box has a higher than average number of mythics, no doubt about it. I guess. Um, so going all the way to the swamp. Hey, there's Helia, the Radiant Dawn. Woo! Flips into Helia, the Warped Eclipse. It's a pretty good card. I'll find a deck for it. Tower of Tawashi, Aaron and Giada, Zada, Virja, Zephyr Singer, and Thalia, Guardian of Thraben again. Thraben, Thraben. Who knows? You can tell me, I probably won't remember. All right, Blossoming Sand, Lord of the Mirror, Azure Swamp, Bloated Processor. Ugh. Now here is Warcrafting Path of the Enigma. Rayab, Dina, etched, Zergo, and Ojitai. Cool. And Emery, Lurker of the Lock. Also cool. Yay, and First Mate Ragavan. Cool. I want him to show up, actually. Like the one mana, two one. You know. Alright, trying to keep it clean here. March of the Machine, Clean Machine. Opening. I love the old school thing, by the way, too. That's good. Here we go. 12 more packs. Boom. So, Mythics. Let's scoop these up and put them off to the side. Boop. All right. Box number... Well, this is box number five in the case. We're going right in order. Remember, Don, I rolled for your boxes fair and square. One, two, and three. <clears throat> Now we need a serialized card so that we can sell it. I don't want to keep it. Rada, Shana, Rampaging Raptor. Oh, Skitherix, like Halo foil thing. That's pretty sweet. I love it. Okay, these can go off to the side. This is not. Yeah, let's put that where we can see it. That looks really good. Cool, man. I, you know, I was kicking myself for the longest time, too, because I had a Scars of Mirrodin Skitherix, and I sold it, and I should have just <laughs> told myself, like, come on, they'll just reprint it, and they did, of course. Breach the Multiverse, Drana and Limbala, Mirror Style Master, interesting. Ingarunai's Quende, Sheoldred, oh my goodness, in Foil and Zirda, Sheoldred Foil. She's following me around now. She oldred foil. Zerda, and let's move on to the next pack. So that's two mythic, one mythic in each pack so far. <clears throat> really, I I I, I want a Ragavan. I'm I know. I'm I feel bad that I want it, but I want it. Realm Breaker. Polychronos Reborn. That looks pretty cool and like his non-foil. Wow, that looks really cool. Okay. Uh, Filigree Vector, Jury, Renata, Chrome Host Seed Shark, FEA, boom. Tesa Karlov, also boom. Okay, boom. Here we are in pack number something of box five, aka my box two. Invasion of Belanon, Swamp. Oh, there she is. L.S. Norn. Just a pack foil L.S. Norn. The Argent etchings. I think if this flips, you can't lose, right? Step one, you can't lose. 
Step two, seriously, why is the game still going on? You can't lose. Step three, you win. Sweet. It's a pretty good card. Elish Norn. Bloated Processor. Sidar Jabari. Number two. Agar, Rada, Doom Scar Warrior, Fire Song, and Sunspeaker. I, I think this version looks pretty cool, this stained glass Dominaria one, but it's just not that great of a card, really. But it's fun. It's fun if you do fun stuff with them. I, when Fire Song and Sunspeaker first came out, the deck list for it, I think, I guess, like the best cards to play for it, there wasn't a lot of different cards you could play in that deck and have it work with the commander. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. Invasion of Dominaria turns into a Sarah Angel. Omnoth. Locus of all. Bloodfeather Phoenix. Chivalric Alliance. Finn. Emoti. Kogla. Looks pretty cool in foil. And Hirobi. Are there any mythics there? I don't think so. Okay. Yeah. I'm slowing down. There's no way I'm going to be able to do this when I'm like 55 which is my next birthday. You don't know, you don't know what I look like. You're not gonna. Forest, Els Pest Talent, kicking things off in this pack. Another Omnath, these are never far away from each other, are they? Tefri's Talent, Firja, Tetsuga, Thrillseeker, FEA, that might be something. And Lathiel, the Bounteous Dawn. Oh. All right, we got, what? Five, six. Okay, so we're halfway through this collector booster box. All right. Kite sail. I like. I think it's cool. Kite sail. We got reprinted. I'm like, why? But okay, that's cool. Uh, Glistening dawn. Itali. Wildfire awakener. Emoti. Inga. Don't have very many of those, do I? Uh, Ayara. Okay. And Hirobi. I'm not missing any serialized cards, right? When I opened the serialized Obosh, it was the it was like the third. It was it was up close in the pack. It wasn't really the very last card or anything. So I there we go. Sometimes I do without scissors, sometimes I do. It's just all according to how I feel in the moment. And there it is, friends. The mighty invasion of Chandelar. I so hope we go to Chandelar sometime soon. Flips into Leyline Surge. At the beginning of your upkeep, just put a permanent card from your hand onto the battlefield. I feel like whoever designed this just said the heck with it. Just look, just do what you want to do. Put a permanent card onto the battlefield. From your hand, I give up. Uh, Sledge Captain. Back up one, back up one, back up one. All right. Umazawa, Rayav, Monastery Mentor, Foil EA, boom! Oh, another Sheoldred Whispering <laughs> This box is full of Sheoldred. Sheoldred, like, is following me around, which I don't think that's a good thing. That's, that's cool. Sheoldred Whispering One. The Phyrexia case we ordered ended up going to Mr. Don's house, and he opened for me. A step and complete Sheoldred, uh, which I'm very grateful to him for. And I may have to put all these versions of Sheoldred in there and just make it a Sheoldred deck. I think I'm going to do that. Deluxe Dragster, Shanna, Zada, Borborigbo, Semphilup, and Lutri. All right. Am I running out of voice? I don't know. I am running out of patience with having to open all these packs with scissors. Jeez, it's like these packs are made out of aluminum or something. Uh, all right, Swamp, Invasion of Amonkhet, huh? Interesting. What is that flipping? That's a bl blue black card and becomes a zombie? That's kind of cool. Enter the battlefield as a copy of any creature card in a graveyard, except it's a 4-4 zombie. Huh. Well, I'll be. Invasion of Karsus. Hoarding Broodlord, Excise the Imperfect. This is one of the better rares in the set, I think, for the commander sets. Uh, Zada, Daxos, Omnath, pretty Omnath, wow. And Gorklaw, Terror of Kalsaswa. All right. <clears throat> Two more packs left in this 
CB box. Norns Inquisitor. Hey, Zergo and Ajatai. So there's two mythic uh, pack foils in this box. That's pretty good. Boulderone, Essence of Orthodoxy. All right. Rayav, Jury, Ozolith, FEA. Foil Extended Art, that is. And, ooh, Yarok, the Desecrated. Narm, narm, narm. Okay, nine mythics again. So we're not totally done. Here we go. Planes. Transcendent Message. Dejeru and Hazaret. Bulpine Harvester. That's a Phyrexian thing. Black White Phyrexians. Yargle. Timoret. Liliana's Talent. Foil Extended Art. Ooh, Vorinclex. Voice of Hunger. Etched Foil. That's kind of cool. All right. So, yeah, 10 in that. Dang. That Elish Norn was a surprise. That was really good. I guess these uh, the Praetors without anything after their name is, is you know, some of the most uh, high value mythics in the set. So cool. Invasion of Chandelar. All oh, good stuff. This is stuff that'll find its way into my decks. Oh, yeah. All right. As fun as this has been, we're, we've turned more than one corner on this. And this is my box number three, Ace box number six. Come to the end. Wish me luck, Mr. Don. Oh. You and I don't know who else is going to watch this. Heck, you might not even watch it, but I hope you do. My best buddies in the world. We buy cases together. Uh, swamp. Here we go. Archpriest of Shadows. All right. Breach the Multiverse. Mirror Style Master. Virja. Renata. Thalia and the Gitrog Monster. All right, we'll put that there. And Lathiel. Yay. Thalia and the Gitrog monster. I saw a meme that was like, Mom, we are not getting a frog horror. Family gets frog horror anyway. Mom and the frog horror. Best of friends. Cosmic Hunger. Yada, yada, yada. New Capanna Island. Another Heliod, the Radiant Dawn. I like this card. Um, Inganesca, Debris Talon, Renata, Emoti, Glistening Dawn, and Thalia, Guardian of Thraven. That was number three for me, I think. <clears throat> Spice. Saw somebody else, else on Twitter, and they were making a good point, but it was just like the death and tax of the Legacy deck has not gotten any better creatures in... Like 10 years. What is up with that? I don't think that's necessarily true, but that's very close to true. Rowan's Talent, Dusk Legion Duelist, Wildfire Awakener, Daxos, Blessed by the Sun, Tetsuko Umazawa, Errant and Giada, Emery, Worker of the Lock. All right. And I think that's all that needs to be said. Yeah, all right, what am I doing? I need to use scissors. Scissors. Oh, eh, see, I'm so distracted by my own scissors. All right. Invasion of Amaket and Planes. Hey, this is the first one we've seen in this old case. Jeez. That's true. I forgot this card was in the set. This card is good. And there's Polacronos, Filigree Vector, Emoti, Zada. What is it? What? Why is that upside down? It's weird. Fire main commando slightly bent. Look at that. Maybe I did that. I didn't turn it upside down, but maybe I... I don't know. That's weird. Fire main commando foil extended art. And Emery, the uh, halo foil version. So, yeah. All right. Cut. Throw away wrapper. Hey. And kind of nice that the lights are staying on this whole video. Of course, I might have just jinxed myself, but who knows? Yeah, Invasion of Segovia. That's supposed to be in this set, isn't it? Switches into a 3-3 Serpent. Non-creature spells you cast have Convoke. Card is cool. And hey, another Excise the Imperfect. Okie dokie. 
Tetsuko Umazawa, Daxos, Pylon, Foil Center, Decent Kill Spell, and oh my god, has there been one of these in every, bo every box? I guess. She Shieldred, Whispering One, she's just all over the place, man. Tons of Shieldred in this case. There, I did it wrong. All right, so there's the common supposed to be undone. Do do do, see if up. Some bless guardian island, golden maverin, regular pack version. Now here's more crafting. Essence of orthodoxy. Shana, Sisay's legacy. That's a pretty cool art actually. Never stopped to look at that. Jury, master of the review. I see a planeswalker, archangel, Elspeth, and of course Lutri's got to show up, but. Wow, that looks really good. Really, really good. That's a cool card. Archangel Elspeth, the only one of the case. Sorry, Mr. Dawn. Oh. Archangel Elspeth, yay! <clears throat> the Atraxa deck I mentioned earlier with the Ozolith had, uh, it had an Elspeth, too. It was pretty... Pretty annoying. And these are not one to come out. Okay. Conshore, Thornwood Fall, Stoke the Flames, Mountain, Pack Foil, Jeru and Hazaret, Sunfall, Fulpine Harvester, Quende, Timaret, oh my goodness, Elesh Norn, Foil, and Obosh right behind her, but Elesh Norn, Foil. Woo! The Argent Etchings. Yes. Yes. The Argent Etchings. My gosh. Hey. Ellis Norm. Pretty crazy art, too. I guess they stuck with the anime showcase on that. Mountain, there's Burrell and Carrie Zev, another Rosalith, Chivalric Alliance, Rona, Agar, Zephyr Singer, and Cezanne, Perverter of Truth, right? No mythics, yeah. Cezanne, Perverter of Truth. He goes in a Shieldred, um, not Whispering one, but uh, the Apocalypse. That's what it's called. Originally from Dominaria United, Shieldred the Apocalypse. Saison is really good in those. Play Battle Fans, good combat trick. No airplanes. All right. C double. Transcendent Message. Conclave Sledge Captain. Zada. Yargle. Tefri's Talent. And Vorin Clex. Voice of Hunger. Da da. Bum, 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 bum. I think he's the Halo foil, too. Yep. Sure enough it is. Here we go. Wee. All right. Let's do that all day. But I won't. I'm almost done here. I got three more packs to go. And then March of the Machine. We move on from that. I don't think I'm going to open any Aftermath. I, I kind of like the set. Uh, the set is medium, but man, it, having a medium set is not the worst thing in the world. Um... It's just, I, uh, you get, you, I would end up with so many of the same uncommons if I opened a case. So, Tribute of the World Tree, Rankle and Torbran. That was my pre release foil. Rayab, Rayab, <laughs> Breach the Multiverse, and woo! Praetors everywhere, man. Original Praetors everywhere. Urbrask the Hidden. This one is not Halo foil, it's just him still with all his limbs while he was still happy. So, yeah. Urbras. Good man. When the Mirans came on down to the, the big old Phyrexian furnace, he said, leave them be. And he was right. He was right. Forest. Ooh, invasion of Ixalan. Doesn't this turn into a dinosaur? Yeah, it does. Belligerent. Yeah, I trample when you cast a spell. He gains indestructible to Leo T. What's the front of it do? 
Look at the top five cards of the library. Reveal a permanent from moment put into hand. Okay. Rest on the bottom in random order. That's cool. And there's a uh, mom and frog horror. There's a castle of broken halo. Valduk. Yargle. Bloated processor. Saison. Perversion of truth. Nah, I'm just kidding. It's perverted of truth. I'm going to drive somebody out there crazy just for a minute one time. And I know it worked. Blossoming Sands, yada, yada, yada. Botanical Brawler. Miragonda. Miragonda, huh? That's where all the vanilla creatures get big. Knight Errant of Eos. He's good. Oh my god, three Elish Norns in this case? And they're all in the back. Don't kill me, Dawn. I love you. Elish Norn non foil. Whew. Boop boo. Vodalian Wave Knight. Dina. Zada. Galta and Mavren. Yay, Dora. All right. So, unless I missed it, and I'm going to comb back through everything, but I didn't see any serialized cards in there. But uh, that was a nice half case for sure. So, maybe I should have been sleeving stuff as I went, but just to uh, see here Elish Norn. Elish Norn. Yay, I got a little bit of time. Um, and there was, there was a third Elish Norn, right? Yeah, Elish Norn. Jeez. And how many Shieldreds did I have? Skitherex. There's a Shieldred Whispering one. <clears throat> These are like old school. Yeah, there's another Shieldred. All right, so three Elish Norns. Shouldered Whispering Wands, Foreign Collects, Urbrask. I didn't get a Ren and Realm Breaker at all, but I got an Archangel Elves Path. Uh, here's a Etched Foreign Collects. There's a, yeah, geez, three Shieldred Whispering Wands. Um, there's a Skitherix Plate Dragon, so, and there's Urbrask. Okay. Overall, it's a cool set, man. It's a cool set. There's something in it for everybody. That's kind of the point. And that's what I like in a set. So anyway, I hope you enjoy opening whatever you may buy of this set or trading for or purchasing, but have a good time. Love you all. Have a good night.